Prisons in Russia are notorious for their harsh conditions. But of all Russian prisons, the Black Dolphin colony is considered the most terrible in the country. Today we will talk about the Black Dolphin prison. A hell for prisoners. Subscribe to our channel and like. In the courtyard of the colony, there is a sculpture of a black dolphin. It was made by the prisoners themselves. This graceful animal greets everyone who arrives at the colony, and thanks to him the zone got its unofficial name. Prisoners are monitored around the clock. Each prisoner is accompanied by several overseas. In addition, when moving around the colony, criminals are blindfolded so that they do not try to escape. Many prisoners who have committed especially serious and cruel crimes will be kept in the Black Dolphin until the end of their days. Approximately 700 people are serving sentences in the colony. According to statistics, all of them in total committed about 3,500 murders. That is, five per prisoner. In the Black Dolphin sits Radik Galiakberov, nicknamed Raja. He was the leader of the Hadid Akash organized crime group operating in Kazan and was engaged in racketeering and raids. Yevgeny Nagorny is serving his sentence here, who killed the clients of his car service in order to get their expensive cars. The criminals held in the colony are under constant video surveillance in order to immediately stop possible violations of the routine and prevent fights and other types of aggression between prisoners. This is not the only way to keep the established order in the colony. In the Black Dolphin, the freedom of movement of prisoners is limited. They are not contained in ordinary cells, but in metal cages located inside the cells themselves. The cameras themselves are only 4.5 square meters, and in these tiny spaces the prisoners live two people at a time. The windows in the cells are narrow and are located right under the ceiling. This was not done by chance. Thanks to such windows, the prisoners see nothing but a strip of sky and are not able to find out how other buildings are located in the territory of the zone. The history of the Black Dolphin colony does not know a single case of escape. According to some reports, this colony has the strictest regime in the country, but there is no official confirmation of this. In addition to life sentence prisoners, prisoners with a general regime, rapists and those living in special settlements are sitting in the colony. There are no contacts between the prisoners. There are usually two or four criminals in the cell. Every 15 minutes the guards go around the cells. When a prisoner is taken out of the cell, he must be accompanied by at least three people and a sinologist with a dog. The rise at the prisoners at 6 am and until the lights out, which comes at 10 pm, they are forbidden to sit down and lie on their beds. The Black Dolphin has one distinctive feature. The prisoners are blindfolded when moving from corpse to corpse. This is done so that the prisoners could not orient themselves and escape. The cells themselves are regularly searched. In case one of the prisoners had something forbidden or someone is preparing an escape. Prisoners can walk only in a special box. At the same time, their hands were tightly handcuffed. Because of this, the hands of prisoners often become numb and numb. As already mentioned, prisoners move around the territory of the colony, accompanied by three escorts and a sinologist with a dog. They walk along the corridors only in the pose of a swallow, practically bent in health. Their heads are lowered low and their hands are handcuffs, are raised behind their backs. Even the clothes of the prisoners, black with the three white stripes on the sides, are made in such a way that when they escape, they can be seen from afar. From getting up to lights out, the prisoners can only sit on a stool, which is perfectly visible to the duty officers through the peephole. During the search, prisoners are not allowed to hold out their palms with closed fingers. Searchers must be sure that the criminals does not have anything between his fingers and that he will not be able to slash anyone in the face. Unlike other zones where there have been similar cases, this does not happen in the Black Dolphin. Electricity here is turned on for only a few hours. In other colonies, prisoners sometimes throw a bare wire. Because of this, the guards receive an electric shock. But in the Black Dolphin, such incidents do not happen. The rules for visiting here are also not the same as everywhere else. 
In the first 10 years, prisoners are allowed only two short visits a year and one long one. And you can only see children, parents and spouses. For meetings lasting a year, separate rooms were created close to the hotel type. In 2016, all major and not very large media outlets began publishing news about the escape of a prisoner from the Black Dolphin. However, a little later it turned out that there was still an escape, but not from the Black Dolphin itself, but from a colony settlement for petty criminals with the same name. Escape from the infamous Black Dolphin is impossible. At least there has not yet been a single attempt to do so. The system of prison sentences in the Russian Federation is far from the standards of humanity adopted in the West. It is only just beginning to be changed. In addition, a huge number of people doubt that the innovations that are shown to human rights activists and journalists are widely used in practice. And many do not understand at all why the prison life of murderers and rapists is better.